Hello friends, welcome back and if you're new, welcome. My name is Nikki. I hope that you will subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. This might be the dumbest most stupidest, I don't even know if that's a word, video I have ever filmed on the channel, but I'm putting it up because why not? Let's have some fun. Life's too serious. You gotta laugh. You gotta have some fun. And I want to try new things because I genuinely wanted to know, can a black girl self-tan? So I was watching Raw Beauty Christie's video. I think it was like her favorites or favorites and hate it or something like that. And she was talking about some self-tanner that she loves, she loves, she loves, and a light bulb just went off. And I was like, could I self tan? I actually like getting very dark in the summertime. I get very dark. I love it, but it's very uneven. It's like my chest area stays light. My neck, my arms get really dark, which you can't really see. I get really dark, but it's very uneven. So I was like, wouldn't it be cool if I could self tan? Yeah, no, I don't know. So that's what we're gonna do and what i had done was i had my very pale boyfriend apply the self tanner to my legs i tried two different self tanners and we're just gonna see if it works let's jump into it all right let's do this first up on one leg we're gonna use the walmart ocean potion everglow here you go babe we'll do the right leg with ever potion i'd like to register my resistance to this process <laughs> just come on you can make my hands look funky. You can scrub it off. Come on, come on. All right. Right leg gets ocean potion. That was cold. Yes. Whoa, it's crazy. I don't know if this one will work because it's for fair to medium skin tones. The little pokey thing doesn't work real well. Well, it is from Walmart. Six bucks. The pump's not working. Are you sure? Might have to just do it right out of the thing. No. It's not coming up. Okay, that's one problem. The pump don't work. <laughs> the pump don't work. Nice. Might have to just use it out of the thing. Really? Yeah, look. The pump doesn't work. Whack. There you go. Problem one. Pump doesn't work. Well, don't say problem one. It might... Oh, I was expecting it to be brown. It's just like a white liquid. No. This stuff. I've used this stuff before. You told me you've never self-tanned. No, I said I didn't self-tan in the spray booth. Oh. Okay, come on. I've I used lotion. It's a, oh, I didn't know that. It's a lotion. Yeah, it's, it makes your skin look weird. <laughs> well, oh, all the girls. Yeah. Show them. Wow. Another thing I didn't know. I thought it would be like brown. No. So it's a chemical. The chemical changes your skin tone. So it's going to make my skin look really, really, oh, yeah, like, I don't know. Well, try not to get it on <laughs> Try not to get it on me. <laughs> try, yeah, try not to get it on Try not babe. to get it on your arm. Come on. Okay. Right leg. Here we go. All right. Right leg. Everglow Ocean Potion. <laughs> Left leg. We're going to use the Jergens Instant Glow Instant Sun. Dries in 60 seconds. Deep bronze. I think this one might work. So this one is just a pump. You just pump, spread, and <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> you made a rhyme, babe. I did? Pump, spread? That doesn't rhyme. And that's what she said. Oh, ha, ha. Yeah. Pump, spread, and that's what she said. Pump, spread, and that's what she said. Pump, spread. Wow, it makes my legs, like, shiny, right? Well, yeah, it's wet. Pump, spread, and that's what she said. Pump, spread. This is a G-rated channel. Hey, you're a weirdo. Well, we this know that. This is not G-rated. Oh, it's not? You're standing on the bed and I'm putting lotion on your leg. <laughs> it's kind of PG-13. Oh, really? Well, at least PG. No, yeah, this is fine. All right, so this The is... kids see wilder stuff on Pornhub. Whoa. <laughs> they really went there. All right, go on. So it's, like the, it's like a foaming thing. Foam, foam. Pro tip for home users. Wash it out of the folds of your skin. And out from between your fingers, or else you get these dark spots all over your hand. This is why I love having a pale man in my life. Whoa, that's we the get only those... reason? Well, no, I, I'm just saying for self-tan tips. Or if you put it on your face, make sure it's really even. And it, if you... It Babe, gets in your eyes, all these girls know that. It gets in your eyes and it'll get in the, the creases of your skin. And it makes those creases look really dark. You told me you had never done this before. You sound like an expert. No, I've never done the spray tan. Yeah, I asked it. Come on, come on. Yeah. 
Oh. There you go. See, that's what I thought they looked like. They don't have to. It's the chemical. This is dye. The Hurry up. I don't want to stain your fingers. Great. Well, that's a long since past going to be a problem. Here we go. Can you read the instructions on this one? I did. It says, oh, oh that's it wow, they all smell so nice. This one smells like hairspray. Like, like hair it. products. Like, uh -oh. What? Gotta Babe! Oh, man! Yeah. All right. After. I guess I'll just check in with you guys for the next couple days. We'll see what happens. Oh, I have to reapply? No, I'll just do one. And we'll see how this goes. I'm sad to report that neither of these did anything for my skin. They did moisturize my skin, but as far as deepening my skin tone, it didn't happen. Some of you were probably thinking that as soon as the video started, especially those of you that self-tan, you probably already knew that nothing would happen to my brown skin, but I was really hoping that it worked because I want to find something that'll evenly darken my skin because I told you, I like a dark skinned look. I honestly wish I was deeper than I am, so. Womp womp, I'll use these for moisturizer. And I love the way they smell. I love the way self tanner smell. At least these two, the Jergens and the Ocean Potion. I'll leave a link to them down below. This smell, amazing. Did they deepen my skin tone? Not at all, not at all. Didn't do a god dang thing, nothing. And I reapplied for like five days, nothing. I was gonna show you guys day after day, but what was the point? My legs look the same. Let's jump into product reviews. Let's do this. First up, from number seven, you guys have seen me use these in my, well, use this in my last couple of tutorials. This is the number seven Early Defense Glow Activating Serum. Moisturizing, doesn't clog my pores, doesn't break me out, and I feel like it actually does add some glow to the skin. I have been enjoying that. Next up, from Estee Lauder, we have their Double Wear Concealer. It's double wear waterproof all day extreme wear concealer. That is a mouthful. This is the shade 3W medium. I use this under the eyes, down the bridge of the nose. I love it. It's full coverage. It's long wearing. I love the concealer and the double wear foundation. You cannot go wrong with those two. Next up, I have a lot of goodies from Clarins. Two of the new, they have this limited edition like summer collection. I'll leave a link to it down below. Two of them that I'm most excited about, I showed this to you guys in my boyfriend rates, my Goodwill outfits. It's a pen, but it has like four diff five different colors. There's purple, green, black, mauve. Oh, so four different colors. Is that four? Can we count? So you, it's like those old school pens that you used to use and you push up the color you want and then you can draw the line. So then you twist it and the color pigmentation is amazing. You can use this on your lips or your eyes. I've really been enjoying this. I've never seen a beauty product like this. I think it's so innovative and so cool. Of course, you know I love color, so my favorite is the green one, but how cool is that? I'm gonna leave a link to it down below. I think that's so cool. And then I've also been using their um, SOS Color Corrector Primer. This is in the shade 07 Mocha. So you can wear this as a primer, use it as a moisturizer, you don't need a lot of it. Or you can use it um, on your skin before you do your foundation or you can mix it with foundation. I like to mix it and it just gives you a full coverage look. I love it. So the, I have the shade 07 Mocha, but then they also have a lighter one that's 06 Bronze. I really like Clarins a lot. I've done giveaways with Clarins. Thanks so much to Clarins for sending me this stuff because I really like it. They also have a new, I always want to call it a flavor, but a new flavor of the Lip oils, this is 08 Blackberry. You guys know I love their lip oils. I did a giveaway with their lip oils a long time ago. Let me go clean this off because I don't want to get it on my white top. This is an actual dress that I featured in my Boyfriend Rates My Goodwill outfits. If you haven't seen that video, I'll leave a link to it down below. And lastly, we have two goodies from Kevin Aquan. First up, we have their sculpting powder, but I've told you guys, this is way too light for me to sculpt anything. I use it under the eyes. I have it on now. Um, I've shown this to you in a couple makeup tutorials. I really like it. It's, I use it as a setting powder and it works great. Helps my concealer to not crease, but I don't know. I don't find that this concealer, the Estee Lauder Double Wear Concealer creases, but I like the way that this sets it very nicely. And then you guys know I'm a big fan. <coughs> Excuse me, I just had some, um, not sardines, is it like tuna? Like those 
things you get from Trader Joe's. I don't know if it's, oh, I think it's trout and they come in like little cans. It's so good, but so much sodium with some crackers and I need to, let me have a drink of my ginger ale. This is the Kevin O'Quan Neo Elixir Weightless Beauty Oil. I like to put this on as kind of like a primer. This is great if you have normal or dry skin, and it's so cool, the little dropper. You push the button, and the product stays in there until you push it out. It's so cool. It's moisturizing, soaks into the skin, gives you a nice, dewy look. If you have normal or dry skin, you'll really like this. So that's it for me, friends. Hopefully you enjoyed this kooky video. If another one of these little things pops in my head, I might just make a video about it because the other day I was thinking, do black girls bronze? But then I looked on YouTube and apparently that is a thing. Black girls have been bronzing forever. I just have never done bronzer. I contour and that's it, but yeah. So some things maybe I should just keep to myself, but some things I'll just make a video out of and show it to you. So that's it for me, friends. If you enjoyed, give this a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell next to the subscribe button. If you don't know, if you just subscribe, you won't get notified. If I upload, if I go live, you have to hit the bell right next to it, and then you'll get notified every time I upload. Check out the videos on the screen. Give this a thumbs up, and I will see you soon. Let me know in the comments down below if you want me to try other weird stuff. like. What other stuff do black people typically not use? And I wonder if it would work. Like self-tan. There's other things I've thought about. These are the crazy things that go in my head. Only children. I'm leaving. Ciao.